that's a super story hi everybody um it's shari Kutsi and uh yeah welcome to the month of march <laughs> i don't know what i think about march and i say march is the not so matchy march growing up one of the months i really didn't like was march because it used to remind me of my chair is going down wow okay thanks it used to remind me of january most nigerians can attest to it this we never liked january and most people still don't like january because it always comes like with some sort of hardship after so much spending in december january comes and it's like oh my god you have to pay school fees some people pay house rent and many more expenses right so it always felt like why you know you know the hardship was always felt and always felt like the month is very very long a lot of people still are in that phase for me i had to do something about it um i grew up that way asking myself what is causing this thing and how can i avert it and one of the things i started doing was i realized okay expenses mostly will mount up in december for the festive seasons you know festival christmas and all of that okay so what happens will be i would save within the year for december in that way i'm not touching my december salary for the festival period that's how i started and so far that has been my saving grace because is there anything i've learned is that if you see something you don't like you can't just say oh i don't like it something should be done about it no you take an action you do something and sometimes if it means to pray and kabash you kabash if it means to save up 1k just to see that life gets better for you at a certain period of time then yes sis do it anyway march kind of gives the same vibe after february you know february is very short so it's like 31st january february 28 29 and then all of a sudden that 31 days of oh my god so yeah it used to feel like that and so i don't know how this february uh, this march will look like february did turn out to be an amazing month for me honestly uh, i don't think i posted my plans for february i don't remember but i know that one of the things i did in february was to overcome my fears one of the fears i overcame and i'm still overcoming is the fear of singing in public so I joined choir in my church and I've sing up I've been singing back up and I look forward to one day leading a song. But it's just great to be the backup and then you're taking the songs one step at a time. That's so cool. Something about overcoming your fears, it just makes you feel like you can do anything. So I have been overcoming other smaller fears. So February was dedicated to overcoming fears, facing fears. I also changed um my instagram uh, my instagram yeah sorry my youtube um name is now sharikati senhal basically senhal means leaving so sharikati is leaving something like that and then i did a part of a adjustment here and there so yeah that's nice it's nice to make you some progress i also got some new followers oh my gosh you guys I'm blushing. You are now one of my elite employees. Also did some amazing things. My business thrived. I was able to to create my own business um, bag. So I, I run a jewelry shop, an online jewelry shop and a ready to wear kind of a business. And so I was able to like hit some of my major milestones for the business, which was one was to get the business card done, to get my own shopping bag done. So that turned out to be so good because I got to do it and I'm so happy. I got to make new friends. I got to make new business um, acquaintances and stuff like that. So that was so good. In terms of my reading, you guys won't believe that the book I've been reading since January, I haven't finished it. Oh my god, I did a lot of eating too in February. Bruh. Like, I kept having friends that were like, oh, let's hang out. And then, before you know, I'm just having me food. And who can, why should I say no to free food? Why? Right? Yeah, so that happened. And 
it was really nice let's look at march i like to have like an overview of march you know just say okay this is the vibe i have in march and then run towards it my vibe for march is i want to set the mundane like really high <laughs> okay i want to set the most mundane goals what i mean by mundane goals like the everyday goals i don't want to say i'm gonna i'm going to read 10 books this month yeah, yeah, all of those stuff no 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 i don't want to do that i just want to say simply two things one i want to make new friends yeah and it's coming from a place of realizing that wealth is not in money money makes things go round, but it's through people that money comes through right but understanding that people are the real wealth the making bright connections honestly is the greatest transformation your life needs so i want to make 10 new live transforming friends i need friends that man if i'm on level five i need them to be like on level nine so that i'll be like oh my god these people are so high up there so that i i pace up i'm like i need to get up there that kind of vibe that's what i want to have new friends friends that add value to my life friends that i can really look up to and be like okay if this person is doing it then it means i can do it and that's all that matters secondly i want to take care of myself more taking care of myself more is generalistic does that make sense is it generalistic term because taking yourself more could mean maybe health wise could mean any wise right but i want what i what i'm basically saying is i want me to be the focus in a positive way so i want to be able to make decisions based on what is good for me based on me now and where me is headed to very important and this me now where me is headed to will help me to put other structures in place for example i wouldn't go out to a place that i feel me present or me future is would, would love to be there right neither would i want to be hanging out with people that i feel me present or me future especially you know is not interested in or considers not proper yeah does that make sense me matters and me me means defining your values that define you so someone said something about competition that i feel like it's not just about competition but we should look at it from different terms like different angles someone said that the competition is not between you and your neighbors you and your friends and stuff like that competition is between you and your future you so if you're someone that is desirous of headed of heading somewhere there's a picture you have on your inside and that picture of you on the inside is what perhaps is driving you every day to get up and i'm like oh my god this is what i'm headed to this is what i want to do with my life and stuff like that right because of that feeling really you have to now start defining what you're doing now to get to that person in the future so that's what i'm talking about so me now, there's certain things about me future and I'm just like, gosh, to get here, me future seems to have these values. So me now, I have to start cultivating these values so that I can get to me future in time. So it doesn't look like just the possibility. It's like, it doesn't just look like a, an imagination, but a reality, a possibility for me. Make new friends, healthy base friends and focus on me, me now, me future. That's it that's it basically so how i get to read how i get to hang out how i get to do other things health wise will be primarily based on what me now not me, me future looks like it's it seems broad but it is commitment to self-growth if that's the simplest way to define it self-growth yeah i think it's time to end this because i'm sounding so serious now so we're further following each other on instagram it's high time we should. I am Shari Kati Senghua, I think. Yeah, Shari Kati. Senghua, right? Shari Kati, yeah, just Shari Kati on Instagram. I'll definitely be adding my handle somewhere here. And I look forward to meeting you guys. I really think it's high time we create a community here. Don't you think so? And yes, my voice is a lot much better. Woo hoo hoo hoo. Bye, I ciao.
bye bye okay no no bye yet i'm gonna say i really want you to tell me in the comments what your one or two goal is for march like you don't have to make it so many goals just one or two goals it's so important right let's start keeping ourselves accountable for the things we say out here and what things we type in the chat sections all right guys bye thank you for liking if you enjoyed this video please subscribe and yeah send it to some, some of your friends that are really interested in doing a whole lot to their lifestyle Just recommend me i'm doing a lot to my life you know so please um subscribe to my channel like this video let me know your thoughts it's very important i like to know people's thoughts it makes me feel like i'm getting to know them and yeah bye everybody